Hey, Leo, Leo, how you doing? Leo the Lion, how you doing? It's your girl, Rue. Thank you. Um, those new, thank y'all for coming. And those that have been rocking with me, thank y'all for coming back. Yeah, I got a new topic, y'all. And uh, I think it's very important, y'all, okay? Yeah, let's see by the title, Blood Type, Don't Get Married Yet. Because the reason why I said that, I remember back in the day, my mama said that before she could marry anybody, they had to go and get their blood check, blood types checked. And see what's in the blood, any sicknesses on either side of the family, whether they're going to be compatible, you know, the whole nine yards. And I don't know why they stopped that, but that is so very important because uh, different blood types got different personalities, okay? That's number one. And then you can have your kids sickly, you know? They can be sickly for all of the um, wrong blood types, you know what I'm saying? So, um, I'm going to go ahead on and start with different blood types. I'm going to tell you about, you know, different blood types. So, if you're A negative, your personality is sensitive, cooperative, emotional, passionate, and clever, patient, loyal, loving, peaceful type person. You know what I'm saying? So, uh, you know, you have some hiccups, you know, whatever. Everybody does. You know, you... Uh, supposed to be on a diet hope you know about your diet a lot of people don't know about your diet the things you can't eat while you ate negative and uh you know the uh pork lamb beef milk cows cows milk potatoes yams sweet potatoes cabbage eggplant tomatoes peppers mushrooms okay fruits melons orange juices strawberries poultry chicken turkey you know wondering what can you eat it's wheat grain anyway you know knowing your diet as an a you know what I'm saying? So say you meet a B, an AB. Okay, they're good, charming, controlled, cool, dreamers, chasers, caring. So that means they might be working too much. Okay, A's can work a lot too, but they might be really off into it. I think Beyonce is an AB. And uh, rational, uh, trustworthy, adoptable, and creative. But the negative, complicated, vulnerable, uh, irresponsible, self-centered, forgetful, unforgiving critical so boom now y'all arguing and fussing they're not considering your feelings they're not gonna do nothing you say you know what i'm saying so now you stuck because you didn't pick somebody another a like yourself you know there was uh uh you know y'all got the eating habits and stuff and then if you're not eating right oh, i want to show uh, or a positive should be, oh, then you should be a vegan. What well, if they got a problem, you're doing that. And, you know, uh, the diet on that. And then you're feeling bad because you're not eating right. And you don't know why because you haven't checked out your own blood type. You know, all this stuff you're not supposed to eat. You know, just like the uh, A negative, A positive has some certain things they're not supposed to eat as well. You know, so you got that. It can cause cancer, diabetes, anxiety disorder, cardiovascular disease. So if they're not considerate, you know, your partner always gone all the time, making money, you sickly have different problems because you're not eating right. Protein, you know, says all the stuff you should be eating, shouldn't be eating. Okay. Uh, then, like I say, a positive A should be a vegan. Okay. Uh, you're kind, shy, attentive, stubborn, you know, whatever. Okay. That's about the A's. Okay. Then you go to the B's. And uh, A, B, is complicated, dual, uh, personality, shy, outgoing, like A, B, so they like people, like to go and do stuff, keep their true personality from strangers, want you to believe what they want you to believe, so they lying a lot, okay, charm and make friends easily, they love a lot of people around them, uh, never dull, poor and handling stress, careful, uh, you know what I'm saying, this empathetic, exceptional, analytical, so, you know, you got somebody might be critical. Uh, say they are supposed to bring the person who brings uh, new ideas to the world. That's a good thing. And new lessons. That's a great thing. So they living in, hopefully, in all self and living to their potential. Then you got the bees. They're very creative and quick decision makers. Not, not good in taking orders. There you go. They're not going to let you tell them what to do or even suggest. They are very focused and want to be the, the uh, best in whatever they do, so they're going to work hard. I know a B work hard. He didn't want to take a break. And one of his people who work with him take a break. He took, he had a little snuff jar with some crumbs of, of some beef jerky. 
that he would put in there. He said it's a foolish stomach, so he don't have to take a break working almost 10 hours or more that day. His uh, crew stopped on him. They went to eat because he wanted to, you know, can you take somebody like that? You know, we're not considering those kind of, kind of things, you know. They came to simplify the world because they work hard, okay. <laughs> you know, they positive, curious, strong, relaxed, but negative, wild, erratic, selfish, unforgiving, uncooperative. You know, then you with the wrong mate, okay? Uh, then you got the old high protein foods they supposed to be eating. Most of them and it's not gonna eat right. The those that I know, negative or positive, they love meat, they love eating stuff, so you're gonna be wrecking your brain trying to make them eat right if you know how to eat right, or you gonna eat like them, you're gonna be sickly, they gonna be sickly. You know, we're not we're not even communicating, you know, they uh uh then we got negative uh negative and positive, be careful of pregnancy. The Rh red blood type could fight the positive blood type when you're pregnant. This blood type is good for blood donation. Then you got, boom, there we go, dealing with the blood type. Then that's where we come right here. Then you got Rh positive, has protein covering the red blood cells. That's the Rh positive. Then Rh negative don't have the protein. So it's a battle when you meet that type of person and y'all different in those ways. Then you got RH incompatibility happens when mother's blood types conflicts with that of the newborn child. It is possible for a mother's red blood cells to cross into the placenta of fetus during pregnancy. When this occurs, the mother's birth uh, blood cells develop antibodies that can attack the newborn's blood cells and cause jaundice. Okay, you causing jaundice in your baby. Because y'all not compatible through the blood type. You ain't talked about the future. Y'all know each other. You're arguing for all the time. You're eating wrong. Both of y'all sick. Probably barely be together. This is not everybody. But it's a lot of what I've seen. Including my own lifestyle. You know, I'm hoping there's a whole lot of them not. Please correct me if y'all have a good relationship. I would love to hear that. Risk is higher during, near or during delivery. Okay. So you got this going on, then you got, um, let's say the mother with O negative and B, you know, that uh, uh, negative blood, baby positive, can be prevented with uh, with the early blood test in pregnancy. So if you, only way you're going to tell them to test that, or even think about it, if something's wrong inside of you, then you're going to tell them, well, I don't feel right or whatever, which I test out blood. If you know that, please know that now that you listen to me. If found an RH immune globulin treatment is administered about 28 weeks in the pregnancy. Hopefully you catch it before the 28 weeks. And then they could see if you and your husband blood type is incompatible. And y'all could, they could figure out to help the baby won't have any issues. If not, detected baby could have, um, like I say, jaundice, brain damage. Okay. Now I was thinking about me and my husband. We both incompatible because my son, when he was born, he he caught stop beating in my stomach, and now he has mental problems. Okay, so boom, let's show you right there. But it's common. They say it's a common. It's common and treatable. I don't like saying common and treatable, but whatever. That's that's doctors. If yellow, they so when the baby comes out, if you didn't notice it, if the uh, yellow discoloration discoloration of the skin or the eyes. Then they'll treat the baby, okay? Then your baby got to go through all of that stuff, and you got to go through all the medication, a little bit of thing just got here, got to go through all that stuff, get angry and mad about all of that just came here. Boom, you know? Uh, so they say they treat it through hydration and phototherapy. Okay, then you got to think about, can uh, I was saying this here, can the blood types, different blood types cause cerebral palsy in your children? Because that's a brain problem as well. You know, they they don't say it, but what if it is, you know? And then you got this other one. Now, I'm not going to pronounce the say, but that's another brain problem in kids, okay? So, you know, we got to think about all this stuff when you're choosing your mates just because they're fine and pretty and all that kind of stuff. When y'all laugh and giggle together, hopefully you know, the sex is last. You know, everybody quick to worry about sex. Got sex everywhere, even sex selling a car, food, everything. You know, just messing with our brain. So it says uh, bilateral blankets and other phototherapy equipment help the infant's body expel uh, and help them with the, the cause of the jaundice. 
genotype compatibility and compatibilities with about sickle cell. That's one serious uh, medical condition with high uh, high rates. So then you got the sickle cell anemia. That comes from the blood type not matching. My me and my husband's like that. Uh, no, not my husband. Take that back. What my first two kids' father. He had sickle cell in his family. I did not. My now my daughter has a trace of it. Okay, so if she don't pay attention to who she's with, and they have sickle cell trait or sickle cell, that children be born with, with blown sickle cell in their body. You know what I'm saying? So we have to consider all these things. You know what I'm saying? Genotype A A A S A A and A sickle cell hemoglobin gene. Uh, on the red blood cells, AC is rare, whereas AS and AC are abnormal, okay? So if you AA and they're AS, that's bad, you know? Then you got to worry about your children have, having all kind of issues. And marriage, AA should marry AA to save your future children from genotype compatib incompatibility, sickle cell, and other diseases. Only cure for sickle cell is a bone marrow transplant, okay, BMT. It has been proven promising, prominent cure, okay, but it's very expensive. Then you got to go through, um, you got to go through him, you or your husband or your boyfriend or girlfriend or whatever. Are y'all compatible? Then if you're not, you got to go through a family member or one of the kids. Then they got to go through that excruciating in the back and inside of the spine they got to go in the bone and get it out for whoever going to do it most people don't want to do it then you got to look for donors that might do it that's more money that's a lot y'all you know what i'm saying advantages of being an rh negative rs with a lot of um the toxic plasma less serious effects you get less parasites that's a good thing you have rh negative and uh less viruses and and all that'll help your child grow you know you don't have to worry about that and your child you know your pregnancy the parasites catching parasites and all that orange negative may be related to reptilians and gods still a question okay so i'm we're gonna talk about that well i say that part right there you know um well you know they say it's uh they say it's not true but i'm gonna tell you you know if you look on the internet you know it's true you know it's in the world this blood type RH can fight child's blood and positive. Child could die, okay? Called hemolytic disease of the newborn, HDN, because the mother and child is from different species. Boom. They, okay. Tell you right there. You know, and they want to tell you all these other scientists be tripping sometimes. Okay, then you got the N no blood, RH blood. That's supposed to be the golden blood and all that kind of absence of the uh, anti antigen. That's what it's supposed to be. Then you got blood type A is the most uh, ancient. And it is exists before the human species evolved from its hemorrhoid ancestors. So they, I don't know what they're talking about. Okay, it was here, A blood type was here before any of them. Okay, R came with the aliens. So the alien was here for the humans. R is negative, fights positive blood. Okay, what I'm saying? So it's like, you know, then B is thought to have originated from um, 3.5 million years ago from genetic mutation that modified one of the sh modified one of the sugars that set on the surface of red blood cells. So that's how they say they may be. Y'all could get out deep off of that. I don't know if that's positive or negative thing, but I'm just my research. So they, another one is mosquitoes like O and A blood. So that's why you're getting bit up a lot. But, um, yeah, I'll read that again about the pregnancy. When an uh, RH woman, 5 to 10% of women, has a baby with RH positive blood, this is called RH incompatibility. Their can, can, uh, channels uh, sometimes times be problems if the mother and blood blood type and her baby is A and, you know, I have a hard time on my hand right. <laughs> Where the mother's blood produces antibodies against the baby's red blood cells when mixed. Could occur miscarriage, miscarriages. That's probably what's happened to a lot of people. Baby have 
anemia and severe jaundice severe brain problems okay but the japanese they believe that you should marry according to your blood type less problems okay now we got the indians they believe in the blood of uh, the zodiac sign but japanese likely to do things a little differently used to a personal matching information whatever that word is gate is the term which means analyzing a person's personality based on their blood type they ask your blood type uh there's a potential for employment and compatibility of two people getting married that's a wise thing to me so america we need to get on that because uh we got too many sick babies and then we don't know nothing about ourselves and we getting sickly too not knowing nothing about checking your blood type my daughter been trying to get the blood type from her baby's doctor for her child and they keep giving her the run around and they just took plenty of blood in the hospital and everything else so don't let them give you a hard time. I'll keep on until they all get their blood type. Because that's very important. You can go through your bloodline, through your blood type, find out about yourself, who who your people were. Don't hold nine yours. You know, evidently they don't want you to know. Well, okay, Leo, Leo. So <laughs> that's the reason why I made this topic. And uh, would y'all like, subscribe, share, and comment. And I really appreciate y'all coming and listening. And until next time, y'all take care. This is your girl, Ruth, signing off, y'all. Bye.